back to my YouTube channel. I'm so excited to be back and I hope that you are too. So today we are going to talk about the nurse's essentials, all the nurses need to carry when going to the clinical settings. These are used uh, when providing care to the patients. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the first thing that I usually find that it's very important is the stethoscope. Yeah, my stethoscope is blue because my best color is blue. So yeah, a stethoscope. This is used uh, to. This is usually used to check the bowel sounds, the heart sounds, and the lung sounds. So during the physical exam, those are things that we also check, and it's very important to hear the sounds. And what can you use to hear the sounds? It's only used through the stethoscope. It's, it's only used. <laughs> through the stethoscope so the number two thing that all nurses need is a nurse's watch yes it's a nurse's watch so this one is mostly used during ch uh, checking of the vital signs uh, especially the respiration and the pulse rate we use it uh, is usually um, we usually check those uh, for one minute whereby we check the time while doing those uh, Vital, while checking the vital signs so it's a very important thing because we can't we can't check the vitals without using a watch then the other thing that nurses need um, and you cannot you can't work in a clinical setting without is an m tag each and every nurse needs an m tag this is mainly used for identification so a patient can easily identify you a colleague can easily identify you so you can't work without it in any, in any hospital, you cannot. So it's a very important thing, very, very important thing to carry. So the other thing that uh, nurses need is a notebook. We need notebooks. Why do we need notebooks? Uh, to write the name of the patients, uh, their needs, and their plan of care. So they are all written in the notebook so that when you go to each and every patient, you know what to give to the patient without forgetting or going back to the files each and every time. So I usually find it very important. So the next thing that uh, nurses use, uh, especially in the maternity, is the uh, tape measure. I don't know why I usually forget the name of this thing. Yeah, it's a tape measure. This is mainly used to check the head circumference of the baby and know whether it's normal or abnormal during birth. So it's very important thing in those sectors. So the other thing is the uh, highlighter. This is used to highlight the most important things uh, that you need to do to the patient or the most important um, things that has to be noted. For example, you have to check the diet. Is the patient a diabetic patient you have to highlight? So that anybody, if any uh, colleague comes, that they easily notice uh, uh, that something has to be like, that something, that something is important, that something has to be upheld, you know. It is also used to, um, to uh, highlight <coughs> the plan of care to the patient, yes. We need to do this, this is what and what is need to be done. So you just highlight to, for, uh, to prevent forgetting. The other thing that we need and, and I don't have is a marker pen. So we mostly use the marker pens uh, in labeling the IV fluid uh, bottles, the cannulas, and the giving sets. This is just to prevent overusing of those items. And then we have pens. A nurse cannot stay in the hospital without pens. So we have at least three pens, a red one, blue one, and a, um, and a black one. These are mostly used uh, when charting down the vital signs. So you can't, you can't stay without pens. You have to write something. And we have to have different pens because when you are plotting a temperature, you need a blue pen. Plotting the pulse rate, you need a, a red pen. And we also have to write if the bowels are present, we need a black pen. So they're very important. So the next thing that we need that not all the people talk about is a bottle of water. Everyone needs a bottle of water. Nurses walk a lot, they sweat a lot, they lose a lot of water. So they really need uh, to be hydrated. So 
I got no power what I want her to do. It's very important. So the next thing uh, that is a very uh, essential thing too, every nurse should have a nursing scissors. I don't have it right here, but we really need a nurse's scissors. This is just to help us cut things like strapping. Uh, instead of running around looking for things, you need yours just to help you cut things here and there. So it's very, very important. Then the other thing uh, is the shoes. I like these shoes, by the way. They're very comfortable and uh, you can run with it anywhere. You can go with it anywhere. Then you need a very uh, a waterproof shoes mm, to prevent uh, from spillage. You know, in hospital setting, there can be spills here and there. So when you have a waterproof shoes, then it definitely, it definitely means that you are very much protected from the fluids that come out from the hospital. So they're very, it's very much important to check what type of shoes are you wearing, yeah, to prevent you from uh, having spillage in your body. So the other thing that each and every nurse need is a scrub. Of course, you must wear a uniform. Yes. So I have worn mine. Yeah. So each and every nurse needs a scrub. It's a uniform that every every person needs. So uh, different hospitals have different colors of scrubs that they use. So in case you go to this hospital and they wear maroon, you'll need a maroon scrub uh, for uniformity, of course. Some hospitals do green, some hospitals do navy blue. So it just depends with the hospital. And it's a very uh, necessary thing to have. You cannot work without having a scrub. So the last thing that nurses need it's a bag, of course. I mean, where are you going to carry all those things when <laughs> I'm not using a bag? So, of course, you need a bag bag. And it's very important. So, yeah. So, guys, those are the things that I found that uh, were very useful. So, in case uh, you remember anything that I may have forgotten, kindly uh, write it down in the comment section so that uh, we may see, all of us can see and learn something from it. And if you liked the video, kindly give me a like. If you've not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel, like and share. Thank you very much for sticking by and see you in the next video. Bye.